Hey there everybody, Arlos here from Ice Games, bringing you episode 48 of my Guild Wars 2 ne uh, Ranger Let's Play. Again, I keep wanting to say Necromancer, I don't know why, sorry about that guys, but it's well, episode 48 of my Ranger Let's Play with Kivina here. And uh, I just want to introduce you guys, introduce you guys to uh, Frosty here. He is, uh, or she, is my new um, little uh, alpine wolf here. So thank you, uh, Phonic Gamer, for uh, a couple name suggestions. Uh, same as... Uh, uh, you, uh, who gave me the other suggestion? Sabrina, you gave me a suggestion too, but I kind of like the name Frosty. I like it. So I'm really, really excited to be playing, uh, with Frosty here. Um, also, I still have my Juvenile River Drake. Uh, I know if on a game where you mentioned, uh, possibly using Scales, but Scales is already the name of my River Drake. Or my, um, uh, my other Drake, my Ice Drake. So if you guys have any ideas for a, a name for a River Drake, please let me know down below. I'm gonna switch you back for Puppers here. And I'm actually going to put out Frosty here because you've got Chilling Howl, so I do damage with that. And um, you actually uh, minus their enemy recharge rate and uh, their movement speed, which is pretty awesome. Especially when I'm playing as a ranger. So I'm really excited about that. Uh, so thank you guys for the suggestions. Also, thank you both for letting me know that um, the the one pet I saw was a the Mistfire Wolf was from the Collector's Edition. I was 90% sure I had the Collector's Edition. But uh, I guess I don't. So I'm actually going to end up... Uh, I think I'm going to buy that soon enough. If I went to the Black Line Trading Company here. And I noticed... I mean, I don't have very many gems right now. I'll have to get some more. But there is... Uh, I just want to show you guys this. Where are we? Oh, the Digital Deluxe Upgrade. Um, so it gives uh, five guild commendations. Whatever those are. I'm not sure what those are. Uh, one time PvP rank point bonus. Two week banker golem. Uh, miniature Ritlock. A Misfire Wolf Elite skill, so that's the one I don't have. And all items for the Guild Wars 2 Heroic Edition. And there's also the uh, Guild Wars 2 Heart of the Thorns Edition, um, or uh, Deluxe Edition. Gives an additional character slot, Heart of the Thorns Glider Skin, Miniature uh, Revenant Ritlock, uh, Revenant Finisher, and uh, the uh, Mortar or Mortar Mouse Bane Guild decoration. So I actually think I might pick up those eventually someday. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you guys like those items? Did you guys have them? Are they worth it? I don't know. Let me know down below, guys. Um, also, I'm going to shout out to, I hope I'm pronouncing this right, uh, Lysithia. Uh, so thank you for catching up on the Ranger Let's Play. And yeah, if you have any uh, comments, concerns, tips, strategies, anything like that, just let me know down below. Uh, if it goes for everybody, if anyone knows anything, let me know. That would be super, super, super awesome. And uh, uh, done enough babbling along. So let's continue on here. So, oh, uh, one more thing. Make sure you guys check out um, the uh, channel update video because I want to give away stuff to you guys. And I've already had uh, a lot more people than I thought leave comments. So I'm really excited for that. So all you have to do to... Um, to get entered in the draw is to make a comment on that video and uh that would be awesome guys uh, but let's continue on here so help make uh storm carl heights safe for travelers so let's talk with crusader uh uh rugen here so alliance strives to provide safe passage for travelers of these mountain passes beset by ettons and other hazards uh tell me about your etton problem so Etten's danger in danger of the Alliance presence, not to mention a local travelers. We'd welcome help calling these creatures. All right. What sort of uh, precautions have your people been taking? Um, we've laid traps everywhere for Etten's. Uh, resetting any traps that have been sprung would really help us. So besides the traps, what else can I do? Uh, what what would I or what would help travelers like me get through the mountain safely? Uh, we've set up torches to mark the travel pass. A lot of work. Uh, to keep them lit, though. Uh, okay, I can light some of those. And what else can I do? Now we patrols throughout the area. Help them by combating local threats and tending our watch fires. So I will do that. So fight off set and set traps for Ettons. Help patrols and watches and light the way by traveler for travelers with torches. Okay, that is the plan. Let's see here. Oh, was that an Etten trap I saw there? I think it was. Yes, it was. So we're going to set the Zetton trap. Zed. There we go. Let's light this torch here. And let's continue on here. Oh, let's actually revive you. And someone else here doing some reviving, hopefully. Oh, we're just standing around. That's cool, too. Uh, oh, we got Netton here. Let's take you out. 
My awesome axe. Oh, oh, forgot to dodge that. Should have dodged that. Silly, silly me. I'm really bad at that. I gotta get better at dodging. Gotta get better at remembering to use my F2 skill. Things you guys keep reminding me and things I need to keep remembering. <laughs> Ooh, got a new sword there. Check that out in a second. Uh, let's see here. Uh, 448. Ooh. Oh, is that, a, that's, is that not a great sword? Oh, it's just a regular sword. Oh, that's actually pretty awesome. Um, you know what? Let's equip that. Switch those out because it's a little bit stronger. Because I haven't used a regular sword for a while. So let's do that. Continue on here. Oh, there's another torch here. Ooh, a new event nearby. I need to protect Soma and search for the caravan. I can do that. And I'm going to chop down this uh, tree first. Choppy, chop, chop, chop. And light this torch. And then I'm going to head over there to protect Soma as she searches for the caravan. Where are you? Oh, you're right here. You're like, oh, you're, you're already dead. Not good, not good. All right, and these guys are a little bit over leveled for me, but uh, should be able to do it. Oh, I do miss the rolling and dodging out of the way that you do oh, with this ability of the hornet sting and stuff. Jump back in. Come on, poison you a little bit more. Come on, we got this. Just a little letting. There we go. Let's revive uh, Soma here. Um. Get you all revived up. Uh, sorry about that. I had to uh, do some copying, so I decided to turn my camera off. So protect some as you search. I'm, I'm protecting you. Are you going to do anything? Okay, I'm just going to wait around. Okay, apparently you're just waiting around. So I'm going to light the torch. I'm going to light you guys. So apparently someone's just standing there. As she does. Uh, let's revive you, and let's revive you. I can help take down this uh, head in here. Come on, come on, Frosty, you got this. Whoop! Oh, keep reviving. Get some extra help for this fight. Drop that down. Do some poisoning. Get my seedling here too. Totally get in the way of the attack here. Ooh, the Vigil Warmaster turned into a bear. I like that. Oh, got a Berserker Harpoon now, too. Oh, someone's in trouble with another Etten here. I think you're not really doing anything. You're just standing around, Soma, so I think I'm going to leave this uh, area here. I'm going to actually switch to my bow here. Get some more damage this way. Range damage, so stay away from the Ettens. There we go. Drop anything good. Uh, some gravels here. Ooh. Got a light torch again here. Well, I passed my. Oh, there's a trap here. I think that should probably do it for this mission. There we go. So, let's see what this says. Uh, Hail, friend. The Crusaders along the Stormcarl Pass spoke of your help keeping the local wild uh, wildlife in check. The Ettens may. Not stay down for long, but any breather for our crew here is much appreciated. So let's accept that. And I'm heading back to you. Yep, this way. And seeing if you got something good to sell. Well, see if you got anything useful. Well, first let's sell our junk. Um, and I can sell that. And let's see here. So Vigil Scout Metal, um, power condition damage. Uh, needs to be level 57 though. Ooh, these are pretty good, but they take like level 57 to use. Which one can I use? I can use this one here, which is quite a bit better than the one I currently have. That's three levels away. Um, you know what? Great sword. Can't use a shield. Mm, the sword I have right now is better. Not than that, though. You know what? I'm not going to buy anything. I'm not going to. I was thinking about it for a second, but you know what? I'm not going to. Uh, what I'm going to do right now is head this way to get to that scout there. Because this is leading, leading to like a level 59 area. It's a nearby event. I think that's the event over here. The skull that we did before. Um, 
think I've kind of done everything around here. As soon as, oh, I do have a undiscovered vista up there, so I do have to go back to do that eventually. But I'm going to head over to the scout. See if, uh, what, what areas the scout's going to show me. As I battle some Ettons along the way, it looks like. Yep, definitely going to be battling Ettons along the way. Take these guys down. Come on. Come on, Frosty. We got this. Me and you. I mean, that'd be awesome if we could have both pets out at the same time. That would be super awesome. Actually, I'm pretty excited to get to the um, uh, specializations. Which one is it that I'm thinking of? Um, not the story journal. Training. Soul Beast? I think this is the one where you like work with your beast a little bit better. So you get like extra abilities or something like that, I think. I'm trying to remember from uh, Path of Fire there. But, uh, I mean, still a few more levels away. Radabuga? I'm not sure what that is. Apparently that is something for cooking. I am not the best chef in the world. I'm a baker more than a chef, personally, actually, to be honest. But uh, that's just a little tidbit about me. <laughs> the only thing I can cook good is a steak. And Brussels sprouts. I really love Brussels sprouts. I know everyone's supposed to hate Brussels sprouts, but I love them. Alright, got two this time. Put down my seed thing. Let's actually put you guys in vines. Whoop, that didn't work. You were too close. I got hit. Let's try that again. Put you in vines there. There we go. Poison you both a little bit here. My F2 skill. And drop that poison down. Oh, got one down. Good, 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 good. Poison you again. God, that's a lot of charges of poison there. Oh, my gosh, is that, that's that's close enough to get hit behind him? That's not fair. That's not fair at all. There we go. You're down, though. So let's grab that loot. Keep heading forward here. We've got one more Etna, it looks like. Oh, and a pine sapling here. And that uh, that F2 ability char recharges pretty quick, eh? 22 seconds. 23, like 24 seconds. It's not bad at all. Get close enough to set my trap. There we go. Etten's down. Oh, I feel like I'm getting getting better. I don't know. What do you guys think? Whoop. There we go. See, look at me dodging attacks. That's right. Using my F2 skill. That's right. Doing all the things that I'm supposed to be doing. There we go. Let's do our jump back attack. I like that one a lot. Whoop. Misclick that one. There you go. You're down. Let's chop this tree. Chop, chop, chop. And chop. Chop. There we go. Let us open this up. And deposit all materials. There we go. And it looks like we're going to head into a new area here. Oh, we got some alpine stalkers here. Let's try to dodge those guys. Oh, can't dodge this one. That's for sure. I think these ones disappear, if I'm thinking right. Oh, maybe there's a juvenile one. I was moving my camera. Oh no, I didn't want to actually attack one. <laughs> okay, so they do disappear a little bit. Okay. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? There you go. Just chill them. No? There we go. Makes the damage there. And grab this item here. So I just move my camera around, seeing if there's maybe a juvenile one around here. I don't see one, so let's just continue on. Oh, the scout's right here. Alright, apparently this is a level 56 area, so two levels below where I am. Not fun. Oh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? That's kind of a cool ability to be able to hide like that. Kind of wish you can get them as actually. I'm going to go here. And take a look. Is there wolves? Do you know jungle stalkers? Snow leopard? No, I don't think I don't think that one I get. Okay, but let's talk with the scout here. The alliance of the Dermot Priory and the Vigil has been constructed. Though even together we are challenged. Care Evermore is under constant attack by the Risen as the Priory scours the surrounding ruins for ancient secrets of the Elder Dragons. 
Okay, so the priory is looking for secrets. That is a dead thing. What is that? What are you? You look kind of gross and cool. And there's some ravens around it too. Okay, but take a look here. There is a undiscovered vista right here. Renown hearts here. Area of interest there. So let us see if we can get to this. Can I climb up that way? Try to... I don't think so. Oh! So we'll run right into an Alpine Stalker. There we go. I didn't quite want to attack you, but that's fine. Take a couple of them out. Why as well? Why not? Um, poison you guys. <laughs> And jump back in. Loot them. I was just going to see if maybe I can... Oh, I don't think I can from up here. Yeah, that's, uh, that's blocking me, that's for sure. Okay. I'll have to go up the other side, maybe? Yeah, okay. Let's try the other side, then. It's definitely above me here. Okay, so let's continue on here. Oh, we got net in here. Oh, I'm just swinging in the air. Forgot I didn't have my bow equipped. I'm gonna switch to my bow in a second here. And my chill ability here. Some more poison attacks. There we go. As I still look around to see if there's a way to get up there from here. Nope, doesn't look like it. There we go. That it and down. Another it in here. Silly it and so many of them. More here. I know there's more Eddins here. That's what I was just thinking. Literally just thinking that. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> oh, wait. You were talking about me, weren't you? I'm the more in this situation. Man, I can't remember who mentioned it before, like, forever ago. But in Guild Wars 2, if you have, like, a, a, mount, like a button on the side of your mouse where your thumb is, perfect place to put the dodge um, button. Someone mentioned that to me before. I'm trying to remember who did it. But thank you so much for that because it makes life so, so much easier. I think it's more poisoning here. Short bow here. There we go. Both Ettons are down now. And. Oh, must have to come around this way. Hey, bunny rabbits. Lots of bunny rabbits. Ooh, got a research. Oh, blackberries. Got some blackberries. I like blackberries. No, Etten! Okay, so let's fight the Etten. Oh no, my buddy fell down. Oh my gosh, there's two Ettens here. I'm going to suspend this whole episode fighting Ettens. See down. Let's actually put my roots on you guys too. Oh, apparently that was too close. Ooh, what are you? Oh, you're for um, the guild stuff, right? That's like a guild quest. Like a boss or something. Uh, green mowers, don't need that. That, that, that uh, Etten is down. Okay. Okay, so I'm up here now. This has to be the way to the Vista. Almost there, it looks like. Oh, there we go, at the Vista here. So let's take a quick look at this. What the heck happened there, guys? Oh my gosh, that is... It's actually pretty intense. Like, the vines destroyed everything there. That is kind of cool. Alright, taking a quick look around here still. Um, let's head that way. Look at that. What happened there? Someone's fighting there, too. Keep jumping down. Jump, 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 jump. 
Oh, there's an event here, and oh, I did. Oh, I did make it. Okay. Um, let's head over here and see what's going on. Uh, defend Cocardia from enemy attack. Oh, okay. So I'm defending from attack. Let's do this. We got this. We got this. And the growler attacking. Oh, oh, oh the, the growl, sorry. I think I said growl. Spirits and doors. Uh, I'm just going to grab this waypoint here, too. Yes, yeah, waypoint for me. All right. Uh, tents remaining. Ooh, five minutes left on this. Awesome. Oh, let's grab the item here, too. I like free items. Oh, we got some more. Oh, level uh, 57 here. That's my special ability here. Put these guys down. Come on. That's my yelling ability there, puppy. Okay, we got this, we got this, we got this. Events are almost done. Oh, event successful. I like when events are successful. I'm not sure what I did, but... Uh, oh, wasn't this event? Okay. I'm not sure what event that was. That was successful, but uh, I'm glad it was. Uh oh, uh oh, things aren't going so good here. On this side, at least. My special ability to do that to you guys. Uh, some more Priory Explorers and stuff like that here. So we do have some help, which is nice. Oh, I've already finished this this, uh, this area. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, there's some loot here, too. Let's do some reviving if I can. Oh, it's one of those chests. You guys mentioned that in one of my other videos. Those chests are, are dropped for enemy enemies. Look at a large skull here. Cool. Uh, I'm going to read that when I'm done. Okay. Oh, we got another character here. Okay, good. I feel so. Getting some help now. Whoop. Got a berserker over here. Gosh, the Grawl even looked really good. Cool. All the characters in this game look so good. Armor looks so good. Like, it's one of those games or one of those MMOs where I kind of want to collect all the armor. Number one, it makes it easy to kind of uh, change the look of your character. Uh, and number two, it oh, most of it looks really good. Which uh, you can't say in a lot of uh, a lot of video games sometimes. All right. Ooh, we got lots of people coming to help, which is awesome. I like that a lot. And more rangers, too. All right, guys. Go down to heal everybody, too. go there we go jump out of the way here come on guys got this poison them oh f2 ability f2 ability oh oh stun for a bit got some more items here Ooh, some more pants Ooh, those are actually some pretty good pants don't know if they're as good as the ones i currently have but we'll find out soon enough there we go Nope, some items over here. Just all of the items. I feel like we're doing a really good job here. Definitely protecting this area. So that's good. Again, one of my favorite parts about Guild Wars 2 is just the fact that, you know, just exploring this area, all of a sudden run into an event, and there's a whole bunch of people here doing this event. Ah, it just feels so, so good. Not, have, not be competing with them. Ooh, another chest here. So wooden chest. Let's open that. Another large skull, it looks like. I like the large skulls. Oh, you have a little uh, sand puppy thingy there. <gasps> Where's my? Oh, is it my green? Okay. Sand puppies are cool. Actually, I've gotten a lot of new pets. You guys have been sending me new stuff, which is super awesome. I love that. Um, age here for a second. The miniatures. A bunch of little. You just sent me some uh, snowballs. I got a uh, mini yellow jackal pup for you guys. You guys have been super, super awesome. I love these little pets. I love my green mower right now. Actually, you know what? Let's switch that out for. You know, let's keep a green mower right now. It fits. It fits my ranger right now. It's little things like that that I just love about this game. It's still fun to collect and stuff. Ooh, got a hunter here. 
Get the hunter down. Me. You have an item for me? You do. Thank you. Um, head back over here. What's that ability? Oh! You must be environmentalist or elementalist or something like that. Alright, 40 seconds. I think we got this. Oh my gosh, look at all the items there. Right, go through the items as soon as one does. Oh, it's like a wall of flowers protecting us. I like that. One thing I haven't done too much, I think my necromancer is really the only magic user I've used. I mean, I guess I guess the revenant's kind of magic too, right? I think they all kind of use magic, which is kind of, kind of fun, but... Yeah, I haven't done like a mesmer or an elementalist or anything like that, so... Thinking about going through and just kind of playing some of my own. And uh, I'm doing that. Well, we'll see. I want to try out the other classes too. There's nine of them, right? So might as well. Whoop. Finish this event successful. Oh my gosh, I'm so close to leveling up. Oh, I did level up. Awesome. So let's, as soon as this, uh, this guy's down. Come on, go down there. I got to go through all my items. <laughs> I was just hoping that we could. No, Art. It's just. I thought you and I. Art, there is no we. No, you and I. We share an assignment here. Nothing more. Ah, good. Well then, see you around the fort, I suppose. <laughs> oh. Looks like they're repairing the fort here. So you climb up here a little bit. Oh, yeah, you're banging away working on uh, repairing the fort here. All right, so um, question for you guys. Has this fort always been like this, or is it like a Heart of the Thorns thing? I assume Thorns, so I assume that. But uh, let's um, use this. So, uh, Concolia fares well thanks to your contributions. Your efforts have weakened the Grawl and risen enough to slow their attacks on our fortress. Much appreciated. So let's accept that. Uh, I leveled up also. Ooh, what do I get? The Twilight Arbor. The Twilight Arbor uh, Explorable uh, Dungeon here. Um, so yeah, if you guys watched my um, uh, Necromancer Let's Play, I did a dungeon uh, with a, a couple uh, subscribers there, so uh, Sabrina and uh, Seven Nine. So if you guys want to do any more dungeons with me with my any of their characters, let me know. Um, I'm thinking. I know you guys were talking about um, potentially like the story, kind of doing all the dungeons on run. I might end up just doing that uh, eventually. I haven't decided yet, but hey, if you guys want to run the dungeons with me, that'd be kind of fun. Even if I'm not just uh, running them all at once, uh, I'm trying to look here, cause uh, where is here dungeons? Okay, there is eighty. So I'm wondering, like, do you guys think would you guys like it if I did a, a series where after I get to level eighty with a character, I just went through all of them in a row with you guys? Do you think that would be fun? I think that'd be kind of fun. Well, let me know what you guys think. I think it'd be kind of kind of a, a neat idea. Letting you guys think of that. Uh, get hero points. I get some rewards here. Um, let's see here. Um, what do I want? Actually, you know what? Before I decide, let us deposit the materials. See what I got quickly. And deposit more of those materials. Grawl paw. I apparently already have that consumed. That's something I need to put there. Get pants that are not as good as I currently have. Okay. Uh, those pants are better than I have, but I can't use them yet. Um, so I'm going to put you down here, pants. I can't use that. Okay. So any of these ones work. So 52 to 40. Mm, uh, 180. You know what? I think... Mm, I kind of like the hat I have on, though. Let's preview this. Let's preview this. Okay, and let's preview the shirt. A little bit of fashion uh, stuff going on here. Uh, condition damage, power, power. Hmm, what are we gonna do? Decisions, decisions. I'm going to grab. I know it doesn't matter too much. Power, ferocity. Let's just grab the shirt. Let's grab that. All right. Looks like uh, a couple more levels to get more hero points, which is nice. So let's equip that. And get rid of that one. That and that. Use my luck. Nope. 
and deposit the items and Unlock the Grawl Archaeological Study Collection. Okay, apparently I already have that, so I don't know what i do with that. I'll put that, that there for now. Uh, that's stuff I can sell. Can't use those pants yet, so I'm just going to put those... Actually, you know what? Let's keep the pants down here for now. And... I think that is that for right now. Oh, um, let's take a quick look at... The H button here. I just want to take a quick look at... Training. So I have 13 points. So I can finish off scout training. Oh, I can do some more marksmanship here. Uh, you know what? Let's finish off the scout training. Just just do it. Just finish it off. There we go. And then... Yeah, let's do the marksmanship here. So, Hunter's Gaze. Uh, lesser Call of the Wild. Grant Fury Might and Swiftness to yourself and nearby allies. Your pet becomes unblockable for a period of time. Uh, there we go. Awesome, awesome. So, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Uh, if you like what you see, hit that like, subscribe button. If you don't like it, see, you can hit the dislike button too. And if you guys do have any tips, strategies, anything like that, let me know down below. Um, also, if you guys have uh, a pet name for the, uh, which one is it? The, uh, the River Drake, the River Drake I have, let me know. That would be a super, super, super awesome and amazing, guys. Uh, don't forget to check out my uh, update video because I have a giveaway going on um, uh, Monday the 22nd and Monday the the next Monday after that. I can't remember the exact date of that one, but that's when the giveaway is going to be, so make sure you write a comment there. And uh, yeah, guys, until next time, keep your stick on the ice.